love working at Flamingo Land and I think it's so much fun. It's more like a family than an employment place, to be honest. You get ongoing training, you've always got support. What I do here at Flamingo Land is I work in IT. I am an IT support technician. So on a general day, um, it's very much active response. So we have a ticket system and um, it could be responding to a broken uh, computer, um, a printer that's not working properly, or it could even be CCTV. It's really, really varied. So I did GCSEs first, they were very varied. Um, I wasn't initially going to go into IT. Um, I then went off and did A-levels, um, and again, it wasn't anything IT related. I, I went to university to study software engineering. Um, I did my two years there. I passed the first year and I left at the back end of my second year. So after university, I, um, I applied for three jobs, um, um, all IT related. Uh, my advice would be that there are several paths you can take. Nothing's clear cut. Um, as I say, I've been to college, uh, I've been to university, and now I'm in my current role. And in each position, I've learned things that you might not learn in the other position. Uh, there, is, there is several paths into the industry. Um, you know, I've been to college, I've been to university. Uh, both were fantastic, uh, and I really enjoyed them. And I took skills um, away and qualifications away from them that um, you know I can have for life. But they just weren't for me. Um, I found that working in a workplace environment been far more beneficial to me and my skill development. Uh, than uh, traditional education routes. I say if you're extremely passionate about um, a subject in particular and you want to pursue it as a career path, um, keep going for it. I've taken every path you could probably take um, in education um, and I've eventually got to where I want to be. Uh.